Oh, ho, ho. Oh. Precious channel. Hello, chat. It is I, your friend, Jerford K. Horkims. Uh, I am joined by my friend, Mike Krakulik, also known as Gorbariel. Um, today, for the next five minutes, he's going to be Gorbariel. But to my I immediate... A. I guess I didn't ask. That's fine. Well, here. Is that... <laughs> this, anyway, this is Bob Roberts. Oh, hi. He's the, he is the design director for this game. Oh yeah. All right. So 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 shit's already real. We just have a sandbox here, so you can basically do whatever you want. Also, uh, am I allowed to swear? Is that you can yeah, swear? Yeah. Well, listen, if your if your paymasters at Warner Brothers don't mind, <laughs> I'm not. You're not going to get in trouble with me. Don't want to devote a part of my brain to not swearing. I guess. No, no, no. And that's uh, listen. We are familiar with this task. So so, but when <laughs> you get but when you when you get the game and install it and hit Brad. A. You don't immediately. Oh, oh yeah. You don't no. immediately just st are in front of a castle and now <laughs> shit's going yeah, on. We're trying a new thing. We start at the end of the game, <laughs> and then you have to play backwards through it. So, uh, so no, we're dropping you in here. You're pretty much in over your head, just so you know. Okay. Uh, I Can mean, I harvest. I know you played. So you're this? full of ammo. So oh, okay. you're not going to get much out of that. Until but you it, shoot but some it, people. is that like a you mine arrows in this game? Can you yeah. confirm it's that? Yeah, mini game. There's a whole quick time thing for it. Uh, All right. So I want to fight some guys. Oh, here's some. That's okay. <laughs> It's been a while. All right, yeah, you gotta get yourself back familiar with what how was to kill. the. Uh... Oh, also, I didn't play on Xbox. Okay, I got this. Yeah, why? Why is the top button right? Oh, look at that. Wow. Oh, oh, ow! <laughs> Take your time. Stop it. Take your time. There we go. So, go. what would you recommend? Yeah, if I'm gonna go into a fight, what kind uh, of buttons should I be pushing? <laughs> what buttons do you like to push? No, hold on a second. It was hold on, or spectral weapons. That is one of the new features. That's completely canonical. <laughs> okay, well, you're standing on top of a gem here. That's at least like a new thing. <laughs> yeah. What uh, does this mean? So push the the right bumper and pick that puppy up, uh, and then we'll just do a little menu tour and figure out something to do. So pause. Uh, and let's go to inventory. I can do that. Yeah. Right? Dude, that spear is gross. <laughs> What's going on with this spear? So, uh, so the, the little lock icon right below the weapon, uh -huh. that's your gem slots, so you can unlock one of those and put that little green gem you just oh. bought in there. So so this is where you, when you pick up new weapons, we'll, I'm sure we'll get some along the way, but yeah. you equip them here. So back out and then go down. There you go. Now hold A and unlock that slot. And there you go. So then press A. You've got one green I gem. I have a gem. Boom. So in the weapon slot, that means you're going to get a little bit of life steal on your sword. I was just going to say, what does this gem do for me? That's all I really want to know about gems. Yeah. So in it increases uh, my max health. In your weapons, it'll give you a little life steal with that weapon. In the armor, you get just bonus. Oh, I see, max depending health. on how you use it. Right. I could put it in either one. And then you see all the tiers of gems up there. They, uh, yeah, as you get a few of them, you keep combining them together into higher oh, and higher quality. Oh, okay. So that's that's what that section is below that at the very bottom, the three slots. Uh, yeah, so you get three of them, then you can combine them and get a next next quality up one. So we'll just go into the deepest part of the loot first yeah. <laughs> and work our way back. I just I gotta get my uh, fighting legs underneath me. Right, so X, Y, when they're on the ground, right trigger and X to do a little ground takedown. Uh, Ow! You can just knee them in the small of the back. Yeah. Works. Uh, so yeah, one of the new things, if you hold the X button down... Yeah, what'd that do? Charge it up, and then what? you do a big heavy attack that's like a big AoE, knocks everybody down. Kill it, Brimbor. Oh, that's right. Shit. I like so that. much more. What did you say? Ghost Wraith. So, Kelly uh, Well, no, that's, that's, that's the ghost person that you like to be? Yeah. He has a name, Michael. Oh, you guys are still doing that with the words. <laughs> All right. Uh, so if you... Here, pause, and let's look at the army screen. We'll give ourselves a goal. Uh, and then you can fight lots of things as you okay. pursue that. So... All right, so the oh, remember the army screen. Absolutely. This is where people like Kuga live. Yep. And uh, so this time we got the guy you're highlighting right now is the overlord of the region. So he's in charge of the fort here. Yeah. Okay. The only way you're going to face him is by actually assaulting the fort and doing the massive Helm's Deep battle style chaos. Yeah. You got all the war chiefs on the pedestals around him. Okay. Right. So they're powering up the fort. They all have, uh, well, you got the bodyguards associated with minions, them. Classic. Sure. Uh, yeah, but yeah. they also each bring like a big upgrade to the fort. So really, so so, so if we click the right stick on one of those dudes, zoom in and see his personal strengths and weaknesses. So he's heavily damaged by range. So that's yeah, a good yeah. strategy against him. And if you take over, you can see his uh, fears uh, dazed by uh, when his bodyguard is killed. 
That's great news. That's good, that's good. That shakes me too. Uh, and then you've got his strengths on the other side, so you can see what he's immune to and what you'll feel embarrassed when you use, and he just... Exactly, but, but he, he's damaged by executions, which is great news. Yeah. That is true. Fire Fireproof. Proof. Immune to curse, beast proof, so no chewing him to death. Okay. Uh, okay, so if you, you also got, if you hit the right bumper here, uh, you can actually see what they're doing for the, the fortress. So you've got your Whoa. assault team over here. Where, where we dumped you in with the save file you've got here, you've got yeah. a few guys already on your team, and you can like upgrade them here. And okay. then you've got his guys, his war chiefs, and what they upgrade. So if you tick over to their side, uh, keep going, there you go. And then one more, you can see the upgrades they're bringing. So he's got the Cursed Siege Beast. So if you, you don't, don't want those. if you don't want to deal with cursed siege beasts when you assault the fort, then right. you want to kill that. Because the fort is a physical place that I'm going to have to go. Right. Right. That's the idea. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a specific place, but it's so, but, but what happens there is determined by these assholes. Right. That he has, and so this shit is happening because this Gorgoroth person is there. So if I don't want cursed siege beasts, and let's say I don't, That's I want to make assumption. killing him a priority. So. Yeah, so you can pick those guys off and sort of dismantle the fort before you go and assault it. Right. And then it'll be more of a cakewalk. The ultimate is you make spies in all the warchief slots, so the entire fort is actually just. So if full I go down buddies. here to his buddy Ratak, mm -hmm. I yeah. can go find him. So yeah, the warchiefs by themselves are hard enough because sure. they bring all their buddies with them. So he like he would be like a triple boss fight, quadruple boss fight, because him and his three bodyguards. If you go straight at the fort assault right now, which you could do if you want, you could just start the fort assault and get wrecked. Okay. Uh, but that means you'd fight all of the war chiefs and all of their bodyguards all at the same time. So if we want to go after Ratak Quartermaster and start to weaken things, mm -hmm. you can pick him off first. You could try and flip him and make him a spy. Oh, that's so are you, that's yeah, are, you, yeah, are you describing a scenario where we can put spies in that entire ring mm -hmm. and then they'll just, will they just destroy the keep for us? Pretty much, yeah. You, at that point, the fort assault mission is more like uh, you just walk around high fiving people lap. and capturing the, the the victory points without doing any work. Yeah. And then you walk into the overlord room and have your, your real showdown with, nope. the, with the boss. Nope. Uh -uh. <laughs> It's coming back to me. Good, good. I like, yeah, the, you, were, you were going after those Ys, which is yeah. what you want. All right, so uh, there's a bunch of new traversal stuff that I'm going to slowly encourage you to use as so, you make your okay. way over there. So, I mean, and I've, I've watched a lot of the videos and I've seen a lot of your interviews. Like, we were talking about that before. Uh, so we're talking about hoverboards. <laughs> uh, Jerry, is that true? Fidget spinners. Mm-hmm. Hovering fidget spinners. Right. I mean, basically, it's all the stuff that you want from the internet. Yeah, it's, I mean, there's you just tweak a little bit on the fidget spinner. There's a lot of lift involved. Oh yeah, it, it generates lift. Yeah. Uh, can I blow up fires by you, shooting them? You really can. Yeah. So, uh, first of all, hit uh, X, and you'll teleport Whoa! into it. Whoa! Boom. Say nice. what? So is that one of the traversal things you wanted to talk about? So that, I mean. Our speedrunners at, at work definitely utilize that stuff yeah. to cover ground quickly. Can I? What did I do there? Did I teleport to fire? Yeah. Or can I just teleport a certain distance? Yeah. So the fires are. Well, I mean, you can use any enemy really as a, oh. a point to shadow strike to. Oh hey, right. I got to jump over him. Right. You also have your might meter charge, so if you push B and Y at the same time, just go ahead and kill him. Right. I got another gem over here. Oh, hey! <laughs> so, trying to look at some gems. You'll also notice when they're coming up and giving you the Y prompt to counter, when it flashes blue, that's your window for a perfect counter. Oh, so there's, a, there's oh. A, 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 an even more supreme counter. Exactly. We added another layer of timing to uh, master the, the counter, and then there's upgrades, like Augment's 2 perfect counter that like you can... You can invest points and level up enough that you just kill the guy if you perfect counter. Oh, oh that's, wow. that's great news. Yeah. I mean, for me, like, it's I want every game to be Guitar Hero, basically. <laughs> like, that's what I want. Definitely get there. There's a lot of rhythm to the combat. So, okay, when you're sprinting, yeah. uh, you can click the left stick and it'll consume a little of your focus, oh. your slow mo, and you'll f run faster. Ghost Run. And then when you climb. Is it called Ghost Run? Uh, it is now. Nice. Yeah, put that in there. <laughs> Is there, is there time? 
Okay, so I can do that. Just I can gotta go translate it to every language. That's right. And, uh, so then, when you climb stuff, you can tap A as you reach your handholds, and he'll like shoot up, vault oh. up over the top of things. So climbing's a lot faster. Faster. Oh, I like that. So yeah, you run up and take out that archer, and see what I'm talking about. Oh. I feel like this is gonna go to fucking. Whoa! Oh, I there see. you go. You got yeah, so it. archers beware. Yeah. Oh shit! Yeah. <laughs> you see what happened to your friend? Two points. Bob, are you okay? Oh, no, I actually did have a question from the um, from Twitter. They wanted to know if Bob Roberts is your real name, or if it's actually Robert Roberts. Uh, okay, so slightly more complicated even than that. What? So it, technically, it's Robert oh, Roberts. You guys see that shot? It, it, that was nice. Listen, we're try, we're going into some shit over here, man. All right. Wasps. It's getting personal. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so it's technically Robert Roberts. However, yeah. I was born Robert Hull. Hull. And then I got married to a woman whose last name is Roberts, and I thought I'm not passing that, that opportunity. Oh no, that's I mean that's a listen. That's a reason. Like no matter what difficulties or complexities there might be in your relationship. <laughs> if you have a chance to be Robert Roberts, you know... You oh. Make, <laughs> oh. <laughs> what the fuck, you brought him up here? Yeah, so that's the, the yeah. other augment to uh, shadow striking is shadow pulling. Summon? You brought, his whole, you brought his whole shit up here and then decapitated him. Yeah. All right, so here's another one, the double jump. Classic uh, video game maneuver. So jump off and then press the A button again, and we. What? So there's a lot of gaps that you're gonna think I can't make that. Yeah. Uh, you can though. But you, you just can have to double jump. So so these right here, this is a. Uh, so that's like a side mission. Yeah. With, uh, with some of the story characters, uh, the yeah, there's a few things dotted around the map. You can kind of do whatever you want. Sneaking around. I assume I can still grab guys from bushes. True. Uh, yeah, you hold the stealth and uh, press X to kill them, or Y to kill them very loudly. Oh. Who writes all the orc dialogue? Uh, humans. Human beings uh, who write for a living. Really? Uh, writers? We have, I've heard of these We have beasts. some awesome writers, actually. That's, that's one of the things we leveled up a lot this time around, is like having a bunch of full-time writers. Uh, <laughs> in studio instead of lots of contract. Oh yeah, because that's usually how it goes. I, I, I have seen nope. that, oh fuck you. Yeah. I have seen how that looks because and basically what you'll do is you'll get like a spreadsheet, like an ex, like a Google Sheets or like a, like a uh, Excel sheet that exactly. just has a bunch of empty lines. Man. One of my favorites on an old game I was working on that uh, I was hooking up all the, the dialogue coming back from one of those Excel sheets that got sent to someone in another country, and oh yeah, uh, and it was like, Here, give us ten variants of a guy being on fire, which yeah. really you only need the like yeah, screams. Yeah, For, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, but I got a whole wider range of like, I'm torching. And, <laughs> I'm torching. I'm <laughs> torching. I mean, you got to put some work into it. The thesaurus is friendly. Right in the knee. <laughs> He's just, he's thinking about it for, for a yeah. little bit. Now can you go in here? Can I, I assume I can go inside now? Uh, no. What? No. What? Not oh, every hey. door is accessible. Take out your rage on these, on these orcs. Oh! The face kick. It's just, it's like, when we were playing it before, uh, when we discovered Kuga, Basically, did we determine Kuga blood liquor. Kuga blood liquor. Let's he be didn't specific. go to four years of blood liquor school <laughs> just to be called Kuga. Okay, but it's just like this is a, a kind of like dark. Oh, oh God. jeez! Ah. There's a kind of like dark slapstick to it. It's like there's one reading of it that's very serious and spooky, and there's another reading of it that is comic yeah, in a way. Absolutely. I think that's, we have to embrace orc comedy or yeah. the game is just too relentlessly dark. Well, yeah, oh! when I, was, I was watching some of the cutscenes in the videos you guys released around uh, E3, and was, these were very personable monsters. 
definitely a lot of the comedy in uh, in the films too. Like there's some good funny orc scenes. Man, what I like the best thing in this game is to just get surrounded. <laughs> it's always like in most games, like oh man, I'm surrounded, right? Well, no, but, in Assassin's Creed, yeah. if you get surrounded, it's like okay, well, I have to do this for a long time. Yeah, I try to get myself into fights I can't win. Here. <laughs> oh jeez. Oh okay. There's one of the guys you have to stun him first. So B, tap tap B to stun him. There you go. Now you can just unload. Yeah. Man, you need some of that pipe weed. Not me. I do. Where where <laughs> they keep the pipe weed at in this place? Actually, I don't know. I need to heal. Oh yeah. Okay. So healing is a little different this time around too. You just um, just drain an orc. So you hold B when you find a. A guy who's alone. And okay. You just suck him dry. Okay. Did I hmm. say that I think, right? I think that. Uh, uh, you tell me. Um, <laughs> yeah, I don't know what you're talking I about. I mean, last time we used to drain people for their elf shot. That's right. That's right. <laughs> so if uh, I want to drain this guy, maybe I just better? come up and. Oh, oh. And you lucked out. That's actually a worm. So now you're getting intel. Oh. So you already know everything about this dude. So if you wanted, for example, uh, you could send a death threat and just tell him you're on your way to get him and he'll. Be ready. Oh, that's new. He'll level up and he'll have better gear for you when you kill him. Oh, uh, hold on. Okay, so if I if I send him a death threat through this guy, through this guy, when I meet him, he'll be tougher, but he'll have better gear. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, that so you can you can choose cool. yourself to sort of upgrade the encounter. Yeah, yeah. You're saying I'm down to have a bigger challenge because I want like I want an you epic to send loot. Ratat Quartermaster a message. Yeah, they, we we had death threats in the last game as well, but we've. Uh, Sort of leveled up all the missions. Oh jeez. Nope. So now he is. So he's waiting right now. He's got his phone. Well, no, right now he has his phone open. Right. <laughs> it's prime now. So <laughs> tasty. Who's this guy? That's it's Scott Tasty. tasty. <laughs> he told you, dude. Scott, dude. I, I don't know if you've heard the underground shit. Uh, from Scott Tasty, <laughs> yeah, but it's, I mean, he has that that century flow, like a, like one in a hundred. Oh, oh I tried arrows. to get it out. You gotta get out of here. What right. are you talking about? You you've got. I mean, options. you're poisoned to. What death. are my options? Tell me uh, about my options. So you can you can call in Karagor with the left D pad. He'll help. Not that direction though. Uh, oh, that was up D-pad, so you went in to check out your skill points, which you could invest. I mean, there, okay, there. So that just called in some bodyguards. I was right, D-pad. Okay. So oh. here come some friends. How do I do the ground kill again? Uh, right trigger. Right trigger. And trigger. And trigger. Ooh. Oh, man. Oh, my trachea. Okay, this is my favorite hot. one. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Oh, good, good man. Okay, it's all right. Okay, last chance struggle. So you wait until the circle gets into the center, uh -huh. and you press the white button. Into the blue part, you mean? Into the blue part, yes. Okay. Wait till the red circle gets to the blue part. Correct. And then I push Y. Correct. Nope, oh. not today. Oh, dude, it's right. Scott Tasty. Oh, oh no. shit. Oh, no. Look at Scott Tasty. You got, got a, a hunger. Oh, and he's got the claws. Dude, Scott's Tasty is no joke. I don't want to buy your CD, man. <laughs> no, it's got the bonus track. <laughs> oh, you got your might charge. You can get wild on him. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, so that took a big chunk off. No. Oh, nice. The reaction times. Oh, he's broken. Okay, you could dominate him now. Oh, if you hold B. I'm gonna. Dominate him, so this is, you're moving into a new genre. So if you want to build Shame. an army of dudes who scream tasty, or this is the first step. Yeah. Fight to the death. Uh, so, uh, so the, the shame thing is like you can only recruit guys who are at or below your level. Okay. So if you bump into a guy who's too high level, then you have to shame him to just bring him down so you can take him take over. Take him again. down a peg. Oh, yeah. so this guy thinks he's better than me? Is that what he's saying? So, I mean, this guy looks like you can recruit him. 
Oh. You, you should you should have offered him a position. Scott Tasty leveled down. <laughs> wow, so that actually turned out okay. Yeah, you, you handled it. Oh, here comes a mounted patrol. Uh, that seems bad. Yeah, so this time around, orcs can ride Karagors too. Wow. Well, that okay. makes sense. All right. I mean, they had him for some reason. Yeah. Spent all that time training them. Uh, all the time between games? Yeah. <laughs> If you sneak up on these guys, sneaky, sneaky, and then when you press X, you can chain, press X again. What? Chain. Oh, yeah. So each That's of those uses cool. some of your focus. Yeah. Sure. As you, you upgrade. Have yeah. The melee bow. <laughs> Legolas shit. Right, so that is the, that is the tower That's... that we see in our Dark Nightmare vision. That's the fortress. Right. Uh, if you, what, me? Oh. I don't know what you're talking about. Here, let's try to find them together. Yeah, I'll if, help. If, if, if there's a dangerous person around here. <laughs> Is that ground attack from the hammer, the, the, uh, the, the ground attack? Uh, so this time around, you also don't just whip over a body if they're on the ground, so he'll pull out the hammer and just kind of beat on him. Yeah. If you just keep mashing X. But uh, if you do the RT and X, then you'll actually pick him up and stab him in the face or something. Oh, that's what we want. You like throwing nice. stuff? <laughs> nice. It's not cool. Uh, yeah, I'll collect that. Okay, so I think I do want to look at my skill points now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Actually, here's a good... Uh, Impetus here is you can look at the strengths and weaknesses of Ratak Quartermaster. Right. Okay. See if there's anything specific to exploit and if we can find a skill that helps with that. So hit the army and we'll so, right, right stick. Ratak Quartermaster. Fear of execution, fear of Karagors. Okay. Well, who, yeah, who isn't afraid of being executed? I, feel I like think that's, that's pretty common. That's ground floor. And then uh, if you look at his immunity and, and hate over there. Poison proof, so you don't want to get gonna poison. I'm not going to invest upgrades. in poison. And enraged by acrobatics, so that <laughs> acrobatics and card tricks. <laughs> he just, he's, he's like, fuck, why? <laughs> How it? That is my card. <laughs> How did you know? Uh, <laughs> okay. Six. Uh, what does he have six in? Uh, so those are his normal, like his strengths based on his class and advanced class. So he's a commander, which means he's going to have a bunch of dudes around him that okay. will freak out when they. Uh, when he dies, they're gonna go ape shit. And when uh, they'll plant banners, uh, when the banners are planted, they're gonna go crazy. And you gotta like prioritize taking out the banners. I'm just That's telling wild. you all the time. Okay. Okay. Uh, Reinforcements. Right. That makes sense. So I think you might be pretty well equipped here uh, if you look at the skill tree now. So knowing, what's the quickest way to get to the skill tree? Uh, character. Okay. There you go. So the Ooh, the mounted skills down there, you've got your your Karagor business. Oh, so there's a whole he's, zone. He's, uh, I think, vulnerable to, to Karagors or afraid of Karagors, one of those two. Uh, he's vulnerable to mounted attacks, I believe. Wasn't that it? Something like that, yes. So you have already, you can summon your Karagor uh -huh. on the left D-pad. Uh, that third one is about the summoning, so I think you could upgrade that if you want and have a better Karagor come in. Uh, so, uh, oh, Karagor Deluxe. Exactly. The rare, uh, dire Karagor. Which yeah. one is that? Uh, so, yeah. That the, one? So, yeah, so each of the skills this time around, we have these different upgrades to them. The little, oh, the little guys next so to it. Oh, I see. So if I go into it... Uh, so you just tap to the right. It's just, yeah. So, oh, I see. so you can upgrade it, and you can only have one of these upgrades active at a time. So you can unlock them all, but gotcha. you have to pick which one you want on. So the first one there will make it a dire Karagor when you summon him in. Okay. The other one would let you summon a grab. Oh, yeah, exactly. Right. And then the dragon one is on the bottom? Yep. That one you have to complete the whole side story of Karnan to unlock. Well, I was going to say, and that's, that's locked for this demo, obviously. <laughs> uh, Alright, so I've still got points, though. Nine points? Yeah. Combat, that's usually a safe place. So, yeah, so he is also afraid of executions, right? So, yeah. Uh, so this first one, you... The way you gain might uh, to use the the execution moves, those like combo button moves, mm 
Uh, we have a few different ways that can happen in these upgrades now. Uh, so I'm not good at undetected. So it's kind of catering to different play styles. Like, oh, here, how yeah, about gaining might each time you're damaged? I'm That's, good at that. Let's let's get that going. So Successful the, sword strike. Mm-hmm. So this one's more classic. This is like it'll fully drain when you're out of combat, but it'll drain much faster if you get a good combo going. Hmm. Whereas the first one is more of like the. Uh, it's less powerful, but it's a little more easy mode. It's like yeah, you're not gonna lose it when you get hit. You're gonna even gain it when you get hit. Right. That's usually where I go. That seems that seems safe. If I can be rewarded for being bad at the game, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> Spend that point. Uh, so there's your well-timed counter. So you could upgrade that. Oh, I like those. Uh, the bottom one is the kill. The oh, top gaining one, might from each counter. See, there's oh, the combo. That's cool yeah. one. These are all pretty Inst- good. Ah, that's your, so, but that's that's the blue. The blue. So it's right in the middle of the. Well, of the counter, right? Punish one elf shot. Meh. So you can regen ammo as you go, which if you're doing the Legolas melee If you are the bow guy, really that's good. hot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I that's gotta try this. Yeah, it seems go pretty it. sweet, seems right? really cool. <coughs> is, it a, is it a different animation? Uh, yeah, so it'll, instead of doing like, normally you knock them down, you kick them away, whatever, so yeah, yeah. you'll just chop them up and stab them through. Uh, Your critical chances increase significantly. Oh, oh as right. long as your history is about 20. Press X. So this is the rhythm one. This yeah, is the, that like, one's fun. One button press per strike to get better crits going. Yeah. Ha! Ooh, that's cool. You're yeah. gonna die, have some more crit. Yeah. Turn the crit up. Okay, uh, okay. So, quick, quick ground finishers, right. something to say there. So this is, uh, this is one of my favorites. Ah, oh, ah. what? Okay, that's cool. Wraith shield. I love that. I don't even want to look at the other ones, but I'm gonna. <laughs> no, no, so, I'm, I'm saying, so while you are doing the ground attack, so perfect the ground attack. Yeah. But while you're doing the ground attack, then Celebrimbor is gonna go do the rest of this shit. So like normally you have to have that some one's time cool. that to one's finish cool. the ground attack. Yeah, totally. And so that lets you like actually yeah. do it. Actually do it. That's very cool. Brutal aggression. Okay, so this is a another level on the executions, right? Yeah. So you charge your might meter, you charge it up a second time, and when you do that execution, when it's fully okay. double charged, you chop dude's limbs off and everybody around gets freaked out and runs away. They don't like it. Chain executions. So I already did that, right? So you did that with a stealth kill, right? Mm-hmm. This lets you do it off of execution. So if you charge up oh! the might and execute, you can aim and hit X again. That's and pretty cool. Kill so brutalize your target. I love that one. Oh, okay, so this is an augment off of another new skill that's more stealth. Like, if you hold the button down, you hold Y down when you're sneaking. Yeah. You attract a guy over to you. Right. Yeah. If you hold oh. it down, it'll attract him over, and when he gets there, the the wraith will kill him. Yeah. Yeah. Fun toys. Uh, drains your attacker. So this changes up what you that's get. That's kind of cool. Oh, right. Oh, okay, an additional life. one. Mm-hmm. All right. Oh yeah, full might. You have to time that perfectly. There's like a little ring that you have to hit I to get that the bonus. shit. Oh, there's, there's a there's like a crit the ring, mm-hmm. last chance. Wraith. Okay, here's another one of my favorites. Actually, um, let's see. You got a few points left. All right. So in the range tree, that third skill. Yeah. yeah. Uh, one of those augments the talon strike. Okay, so this the parent skill here is you can <laughs> hold aim while you're flying through the air, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, and then that lets you just aim at the ground and hit X and you just like oh, shadow strike man. to anywhere. That, uh, oh wow, so there's another traversal skill exactly. too. Or one focus consumes slower, or... Really? There's just two on that one. Oh, there's only two, that yeah. makes sense, I'm not stupid. <laughs> uh, I gotta get it then, yeah, that's really cool. So, but but you already have the ability to to jump off of something and then do the pause in the right, air right. arrow shot. Oh, I always like that. The, the ally, the allies free flee. Yeah, well, they don't like it. But also, you're doing you're doing something mean. Yeah. <laughs> hey, stop it! You're like we hate it. Yeah, we know about that. Spiders, oh, spiders. Oh, what the. Yeah. That's gross. <laughs> so uh, yeah, that's the if you put out the fire, in come the spiders. That one lets you just shoot it from uh, a distance, uh, kind of like last time. Yeah. And then this one's the same thing as spiders, but brings in the ghouls. I, Which one do we spiders like? Spiders is pretty great, I think. It's, well, I mean, the spiders have the maximum. Yeah. Okay, uh, that's all my points. Yeah, yeah, it's, but spiders are going to give us the maximum, like um, slapstick. <laughs> 
So is my current target right? Right there. Yeah, so he's right. Yeah, there it the, is. The mission for the death threat there waiting for you. Okay. Killing his warriors without triggering the alarm. Okay. I, I feel like that might be. I'm good at that. I don't know what you're talking about. Okay. So he's in hiding. You gotta get his attention, bring him out. He's he's this one. He kind of pulled the death threat where he's scared of you. Okay. It was never going to end well for you. He hiding in there. So that's the alarm. You don't want to raise that. Oh, I don't want to raise the alarm. All right. So it's time to get sneaky. Time to get sneaky. Ten this enemies. is where I excel, as Jerry will tell you. Oh shit. Oh boy. <laughs> Do they have an that alarm out here? All right, take it easy, guys. So that's, that's the guy you gotta stun with B. Right, okay. Nice. Haha! No alarm. Oh, that's their front door, okay. <laughs> Go to this side. <laughs> Climb up one of these towers. There's probably an archer up there. Okay. This is one of those missions I like. I, I always do it stealthy, but uh, one of my friends at work is obsessed with doing this by just running in and getting everyone's attention and then just trying to juggle. Oh, oh and then just trying to juggle. The Basically, just like that main thing. Usually how I play. But I'm going to be good. I'm going to try to do it right. Okay, so. Okay, so you, this is going to be. Uh, Good double jump. Oh yeah. Oh, double jump. I gotta remember that I have that. That's it's a good, uh, especially useful around the fort. There's lots of gaps. Very sneaky, Michael. Yeah, you see how I'm sneaking? I love it. Shit. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think they heard my the quietest spirit move Nova in the yeah. book? Oh, okay, you shadow strike to that archer. Just, just put your body where his body is. Okay, so I go like this. Yeah. And then I X. do X. Or okay, one more turn. That hellhawk interrupted this. Oh my! Oh my! Oh! There's another one right there. Can I do it again? You have ammo. That's fun. Okay, now be careful. Be careful here. Is that their guts falling? It is, yeah. And his head's going. Man, wild. you guys worked really hard on the guts falling. Sound. That's a whole department. <laughs> yeah. Get low. Get low. Okay, now put your right hand in. Yeah, exactly. <gasps> Stealth dominate. There's, there's also bait hanging there off of that rope. So you can shoot that and get some more critters running in to kill guys for you. I want to stealth dominate this guy though. Okay. Or so if you're, you you just let off the trigger right. gently, and then right trigger, uh, you can sneak uh, up. Uh, oh, there you go. B. B. There you B. go. There we go. Man. Now he's he yours. He didn't even know he got dominated. Go down there. Get him. And will his kills count toward our kills? Yes. Oh, really? It'll count against my so. 10? No, it, what can, is that? Can Tikalian join the Rebel Alliance? <laughs> <laughs> uh, is it lava oh, hot? It is hot. It's so okay. hot. What are you doing down here? I wasn't trying to get down here. Don't mind what if me. I throw that? Is that... <laughs> this guy is strong. What the fuck? Shoot that and blow it up? No, okay. Things escalated quickly. Is this guy going for the alarm? Get, you gotta get him. Oh, oh the O logs. Oh, geez, B. I gotta, I gotta hit B there. Why is another? Whoa, shit! Nope. If you can kill three of them. One more. Oh, that guy's going for the alarm now. What? This guy up here? 
Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Oh, oh. What? Left trigger. Left trigger just just hold it down and yeah. Oh. Fuck him up. Yes. Alright, you got him out. Now you just have to actually kill him. Rat attack. Hiding, did you? Ask yourself this, Grey Walker. <laughs> Am I following your plan? Yeah. Or are you following mine? Oh, I hadn't thought of that actually. That's fair. <laughs> you you don't have a lot of health. Yeah, I know that. But I know that he's scared of executions, which is a rare phobia. Oh, that was great. Suck it. Suck him dry. Oh, wrong. Get his elf shot. I should have got his elf shot. Sneak up on him. That's the plan, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh my. Oh! I'm used to death threats. I'm being stopped. That's a new one. You got me curious, Grey Walker, but not so curious that I'll let you live. Well, we'll see about that. Nice. Oh, fear of executions. And now he's dazed, which turns off all of his immunities. Yeah. Oh, there's the perfect counter. Just killed that guy. Yeah, I'm fast. Oh, you're taking him out. Oh. Are you gonna kill him and get his loot, or I, I recruit want, him? I want his here? loot, I think. Oh, another Oh, captain. no! Execution. Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. with the arms into the lava. Oh, you're lucky. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, he did make it in the lava. Nice. No. All right. Oh, now oh, geez, his oh, now boy. buddies are mad though. You have to. Uh oh. Oh, oh I no. wasn't ready for that. So, two, two horns like, oh shit! It makes me a talk killer. <gasps> no, talk slayer. Mm, I quite like the sound of that. Talk slayer. From now on, I will be known as the talk slayer. <laughs> he's gonna be a real asshole in there. there. Yeah, he's lost it. Oh no! Now he's got to fight his way in. Really? I didn't think Two Horn had it. I would not have called that from Two Horn. Oh shit! Two Horn the Tark Slayer. But the best part, I mean, think about what a rush that's got to be for him. You just killed this rat <laughs> yeah. guy. He comes in there, hits you one time, and you die. And now look at this promotion he just got. I got to go find him now. Yeah. So this is yeah. You, know, you go back after the guy that killed you. He's yeah. he's got the revenge icon ready to rock, which means again you get better loot from following from up on that story. Now, should we, so that, that uh, loot that was in there, should we be going in there and getting yeah, that? Yeah, I need to go back and get that. Yeah, it's waiting for you in there. That's unfortunate. Yeah. Is it marked on the map in some way? Uh, it is on the mini-map when you get back in there. Okay, but it was... It was down in the middle of the fort down here, so... It's right, of, inside, it's right inside by the lava. That's yeah. a cool map. Oh yeah, so it's actually 3D. It is 3D. That's true. That's true. Okay, so I gotta go. I gotta go down there and get inside so again. It's, yeah, it's right by the tree of Gondor. That's totally not a Rebel Alliance. No, symbol. it's not the Rebel Alliance, and people who think that are dumb. <laughs> who would think that? Certainly not our lawyers. Oh, and do the do the cool thing where you kill a bunch Ooh, of. Oh, how they love the darkness! Soon they will drown in my light. Oh, trick it! Yeah, he wasn't, tender. He wasn't ready for that shit. Now, so. lava. So it's up this tower. Yeah. Whoa! <laughs> the easy tiger. Yeah, you weren't kidding about the traversal. What is this? So that's one of the um, draw missions for the war chiefs. Oh right. Okay. There's a treasure orc. Give treasure you, orc. Give you a little Mirian. 
I love treasure. Okay. Now, so we should be able to see the la- this lava river. Yeah, it says right to your left there. It's like, yeah, right on the other oh, side of yeah, that. Yeah, it is, right over there. Doorway. So just huh. double jump over those Karagor Double riders. jump, right. I'm gonna double jump over them onto this thing. You got this. Whoa! Oh! You really, you really jump. When you jump. Yeah, let's the sound of what? Oh, hi. Oh, he All doesn't right, like it's it. It's down, down here. I thought it was right down there. Other side. It's right below there me. There it is. There it is. Yeah. It's a tab B to drop down. R B, pick it up. All right. So okay. up on the D pad, we'll jump straight into it. Hold on just a second. I will deal with you. Or yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, okay, his, this is a good example, too. The the loot, obviously, last time it was very limited in mm-hmm. terms of kind of the RPG loot. This well, time it's got the whole, like, different weapons and armor and the customization of the look changes and everything. Well, yeah, I mean, because you, you... He had specific swords. Right. I mean, uh, that, that's a big part of it, right? I mean, how do, yeah. you, how do you do that? Like, how do you offer people, like, visually novel gear while still maintaining the narrative shit. So the way we think about it is like, he's possessed by the spirit of Celebrimbor, who oh, is the I greatest see. smith of the Second Age. So that's more like inspiration to forge like spiritual. a better I see. piece. So, uh, so this thing, the, the big addition here, deepening the gear, you've got Rattak Quartermaster's name on there, right? Yeah. And the uh, stealth kill uh, an enemy while mounted on a Karagor. There's a little like dynamic challenge. Built into this weapon. Yeah, so if you want to like upgrade this weapon to its sort of perfect form and give it its more Tolkien-y like Oof. iconic name and unlock, like that. unlock well, that special property. D- does it have another name? Yeah, so right now it's just a ranger's dagger, but right. when you upgrade it, it'll get a name that is, you know, in cool. line with the uh, challenge and the the property that it unlocks when you do the challenge. So it's sort of like letting the nemesis system bleed into the gear. Let that guy's Whoa. story continue. You kind of keep building his little legend inside. Ooh, your Ooh that's hot. God. So this, this is this is what I was trying to figure she out. Exfoliates. Yeah, it reveals skin's precious layer. <laughs> this is what I was trying to figure out because I mean everybody basically said that the age of the nemesis system was upon us. Yuck! Ooh, that's right? really cool. After, I mean, everybody makes up all these little, these these strange little stories in their game. So what? How many years go into something like before we knew about Shadow of Mordor? How many years went into making that Nemesis system uh, well, do so that and feel like it? We were working on that stuff for about three years. Was it always... No, did you have that Nemesis system before you had uh, an application of the license? So we... Uh, we had been doing, like... We had other Lord of the Rings games going and... Oh, lots back uh, then, yeah. Yeah, and so the license was always there as a, as a possibility. The Really, this is, like, the first game was one of the, one of the few times I've seen where, like, the earliest kind of... Uh, mock-up concept video stuff that some of the artists put together of like, let's try and visualize what this game will be like, really focused on some of those Nemesis system elements, like a guy killing you and learning his name yeah. and him getting promoted. And, and when I go back and I watch the early, like, kind of animatic uh, storyboards of that stuff, it's like, oh yeah, that's pretty it much what we shipped. And usually it's not like oh, no. Usually like it evolves dramatically from beginning to end. No, I've only made a couple games and that's never happened. Such yeah, so that that core. I mean, lots of other things about the game obviously and iterated and changed a lot around it. But that core of the the nemesis but stories was really was there. Is this some no kind of great pot? This is the best pot. It's Should I know about that one? It's a dank pot. So <laughs> the this M4. Uh, it is older than it appears. So the, that's it kind of a we reclaimed it then. A story oh, thing. With their grog. Yeah. Early on in the game, you meet some Gondorians, and the Gondorian city is broken looted. beast. Oh yeah, there you go. Yeah, we can. Now hold on. No, if we want to upgrade your, if we want to upgrade your, oh, I can we can pick shit up on from the, the yes. Terragor. Um, so if we want to get uh, that dagger up to the right level, is that something that doing the cool you, Jerry? shit? Well, yeah, but I'm saying that like. We have to do something from a Karagor. We need like three stealth kills from right, the Karagor? Right, that's a good call. So stealth kill while you're mounted three times and you can it. then upgrade that. That's good, yeah. 
Now that will show. kill an enemy while mounted on a Karagor. So same deal, right trigger, and you'll get How do you Karagor sneak? Sneaky. Oh, he sneaks too. He sneaks, yeah. But he's a cat, right? I mean, he's exactly. a stalking cat. Exactly. Be careful. And he can climb everything too, by the way. You can, you can get up on those rail runs and run across. Oh. Really? Yeah. Just, all right. <laughs> Cats are amazing. Well, you're not telling me something I don't know. Whoa. Yeah. Shit. Man. Oh, the, is that, oh yeah, stealth kill that dude. So, right trigger and X. Yeah. There There's you one. Go. one down. Oh, yeah, get that. Yeah, dude. Another one. Those are the, so those are force tokens. <laughs> <laughs> this, I mean, confirm yeah, on this range. stream today that Talion becomes a Jedi. <laughs> he already has a lightsaber. I mean, it seems more likely that he goes Sith to me, but yeah. we'll, we'll see yeah. how it goes. Is there, another, is there another tasty enemy down there? I think he's too far. Oh! No! <laughs> Meant to do that? That's oh not boy. safe. Yeah, so the the combat on characters combat. Is, it's more like Italians on foot it's combat. It's regular combat, yeah. So yeah, you just counter and right. combat circle attack. Ooh, fill dude. up your might, execute. Actually, also, you can, uh, now you can hit A and X at the same time on these guys, and they'll howl and bring in some more Karagors. Really? Like cool ones? Like Karagors that are down? All right, all right, try sneaky, this again. Sneaky, sneaky. But nope. quick, but quick. Yeah, there's one. Delicious. No, you can't, you can't win. There's one of my buddies. Oh, no, you know, you're chewing. They are cool. <laughs> oh, there you go. Okay. Nice. All right. So now if you go back into that menu. Yeah. Oh, and a new gem, too. Delish. Inventory. So now that... So now you hold down the X button. Oh, and then you use oh, that. And you, use a, you, use, you invest the subcurrency. And now it is Hunt's Blade instead of Ranger's Dagger. Oh, oh and it has a cool look. Oh. Yep. Upgrades the visual appearance. Also, it... Uh, it Slips in the uh, little little oh, bit of lore. lore. Yeah, that's cool. And unlocks huh. that property. So now you get four elf shot every time you stealth kill while riding these guys. Okay. Dude, I just want to hang out with this Karagor. I thought it was exciting having one Karagor. But if we're Should gonna I be put my gems in, probably. Yeah, yeah. It'd be, it'd be worth looking at. I mean. I think that some of these are probably good. Yeah, so you can unlock more gem slots for the different uh, weapons. Yeah, so if I go to my armor and I unlock a gem slot, what kind of stuff can my gems do here? Let's take a look. And you have enough to make a nicer oh, green one. Oh, yeah, to, to, we can compress. Increase damage with, oh yeah, so hold, hold X, X yeah. forge gem. Ah, so Whoa. it's one greater. Mm-hmm. No, it's always going to be an increased oh, version so of the base. Right. Like, right. It isn't they, radically different between no, the greens. Stronger and stronger and stronger, but the same. Uh, so I can increase thing. damage overall. I can get a little more health. A little lifesteal, yeah. Or I can get a bonus to XP. XP. Oh. What's chat think? Oh. Yeah, we want XP. I can't we want life for raw damage. I like being able to slot something into the armor that increases damage, though. Yeah, I might have to go with that. Delish. Health, health, DPS. These are all classic. Yeah, those are great choices. These are all classic. Oh yeah, for the stream damage. Raw damage. That's busted. Is 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 dropping some science. Okay. All right, and so this is these are the coins that we're getting when we get that right. when we when we go and extract that icon. Uh huh. I can just put the health in my hat. Hat health. Oh, and I got a cool ring. Yep. Increased chance that enemies killed by this weapon drop. Mm-hmm. Are this called Lord of the Rings bucks? It's Mirian. Oh. Yeah. Mirian. <laughs> Close. 
<laughs> Tolkien cash? <laughs> Tolkien, it's gonna be bucks. Tolkien bucks. Uh, okay. No, no, toll coins. <laughs> That's pretty good, actually. I would collect those. J.R.R. Toll Coin presents. Hey guys. Hey fuckers. <laughs> it's a little you nibble. You the ground takedowns on him too when you oh. knock him down. Oh! There. All right. We don't, we don't have to do shit. The other Karagor is just going to work. Yeah. So here's your revenge target. You hop off your Karagor and start that. Let me deal with these hooligans real quick. You can howl in another Karagor if you want to. They're definitely insolent. I would say this is an insolent uh, sort of scenario. Uh-oh. Oh, oh no. I got your leg. Got your leg. <laughs> Man. So our character is pretty good, or good to have him? Man, he's <laughs> right behind that pole. There we go. Hurt. Wait, he's an orc tactician. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Okay. See you, dude. Yeah, two horn, the Tark Slayer. We are close to a slave team. Oh, he's tracking. I wonder if that would be any comfort to them if they knew it. So they get taken down a notch. Right, right. And so this was this this mission was generated by the by our ignominious defeat. Exactly. He killed you, so now he's all over here waiting to be got. <laughs> What's up, Super Mario type <laughs> shit? <laughs> you can bop on their heads. So if you uh, hit the left bumper, go in the Wraith world, look around for him. You're in this kind of green area on the mini-map, you can- ah, oh, there we go. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Here, no, no, no! Okay, so he's fireproof. What's he, what's he hate? He hates Michael Buble. No. <laughs> he's enraged by cowards. That's an interesting one, okay. He... He's a tank. tank. Really? I wouldn't have called that. Determination. Unlikely tank. Oh, he heals himself. Mm hmm. hmm. Pushes back and disorients. Keep that in mind. Okay. He's a machine tribe, so he's got this hook that kind of Grab does the scorpion uh, get over here action. Uh, class bonus, frontline warrior. Wow, he seems like he's going to be a real pain in the ass. Yeah, he really does. And he's got a gang. Of course he does. So you don't know any of his weaknesses. That'll not That's going to be tough, but everybody's weak to dying. To death. I discovered. <laughs> I love off the off the top rope. Is he like in a cave? Oh, he's below me. Oh, shit. oh geez. I didn't mean to be hitting that guy. No, I don't. There you go. There we go. Oh, oh, just talent strike right down there. Tried to get, get in there. Get yeah, him! Nope. Nice. nice. Oh! Oh! Right in the zone! Right in the orc spot. You don't <laughs> seem to get it. We've been down this road before. I'm the Tark Slayer. <laughs> yeah. I killed Tark. Oh, I get it. <laughs> and you're a Tark! <laughs> okay, yeah. It makes sense, man. <laughs> I was with you from the very beginning. <laughs> well, the... <laughs> Oh! Uh-oh. I still hurt him. Yeah, I did. Ooh, oh. oh, there's a barrel up there. Oh, that's right. He actually healed up all that oh, damage. Oh, yeah, you gotta keep an eye on this oh, yeah. guy. When he's doing that move, you can interrupt him to yeah, cancel the it, so... Ah, oh, there we go, okay. There we go. Nice. Oh! 
Okay, so you just did the consume, like, immediately yeah. dominate that guy in the middle of combat. Oh, there's his stun. Well, you're just giving him somebody else to fight. Plus, that heals you this time, yeah. so... so nice to have a friend. Right? Yeah, it is. Gotcha. There we go. Can I dominate him? Oh. Oh! Fight over and me defeated. Uh, you'd like that, wouldn't you? Oh, it was a trick. Oh! Oh! Death defying! Kick ass! Go again. Fuck you! Oh, dude, that was, that was your instant! Yeah, that was a good one. Oh! oh. So oh, dude, it is you and two of your guys now. Yeah. Oh, right on the ground, get him! Oh! Man. You might be right. I'm having a hard time. There we go. Oh! That was a good one! Yeah! I dominate him. Oh yeah, you could add him to your army. Have another dude for the assault. Okay. Or, oh yeah, so hold B. Yeah, get his juice. You will, Neil. Yeah, recruit. Recruit, okay. Oh, oh two horn Tark Slayer. Okay, so he's already somebody's bodyguard, which means that oh. your X button option is to just make him a spy. So, here's yeah. the thing. You can have him as a spy, then whenever you find that war chief, he'll be there with him, stab him in the back, all that business. Well, right? that'll, that'll sort of start things off. Yeah, that'll be nice. Uh, if if he's a spy, he's kind of locked up being uh -huh. a spy. Okay. You can also set guys to be your own bodyguard, and then you can just call them in on the right D-pad whenever yeah, you want. Yeah, for me. Uh, so there's I gotta there's see options. this spy. Okay. As you wish, bright lord. Yeah, yeah. So, but but this is this is all off of the, all this cash here. Yeah. This is off of the rune that you set. I mean, I, I bet that's I being bet generated. Is, yeah. I bet that's being generated by the rune. Okay. So now, if I go look at the army, here's my man, Two Horn the Tark Slayer, and he works for this guy who I don't know. Right. That's Not right. Yet. That's right who's got three other bodyguards. So if I want to find out about him, I should probably go to one of these guys first? Uh, if you want to learn his strengths and weaknesses and everything, just find a worm anywhere in the world. Oh, okay. Oh, and choose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, so I actually, we have a cool thing that our engineer put together for us uh, that'll harvest questions uh, out of the zone. Um, so uh, I was curious about this too. So we were getting health back by grabbing it. Are, are we picking up? Uh, elven herbs and things like that through the world? Oh yeah, no, I haven't seen no. a single herb. Those are gone. Uh, the closest thing really is, the since drain is how you get health, uh, Right. there's lots of rats wandering around. You can just uh. suck a rat to death. Oh, any any of the ambient animals? Yeah. Just like in Spokane, where we grew up. Mm -hmm. That's <laughs> normal, right? Hey, can you dominate Olags? Uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, there's, there's skills. So if they're a captain, you gotta break them first and then you Yeah, yeah, yeah. If it's a, a grunt Olog, then you need a skill to be able to dominate them, but it's possible. Yeah. Oh, right, through. Oh, I gotta remember I can chain that. Uh -huh. And how, how do we chain that? You just point at the next target and hit X. Oh, off of an assassination. Yeah. 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 Now, uh, I was curious about this too. Are we looking at, like, is this like end game shit? Like the stuff that we're pulling with Talion? So yeah, we, we, I mean, you saw the skill tree, you had all of the parent skills yeah. unlocked, and we gave you 10 skill points to work with on top of that, so we are, this is the last, kind of, the highest difficulty zone 
on a normal playthrough on sort of normal yeah. difficulty oh! here. Right. But we gave you a lot of upgrades at the same time, so. Okay, so you grow up to this. Yeah, yeah, and your gear is, you know, we, we started your gear at a pretty high level to help deal yeah, with it. Yeah, it looked like it was all like level 31 or something yeah. like that. I love that spring. Oh, yeah. There you go. So here's your here's a good, like, this is the, the thing that speedrunners love from adding the aerial ranged and talent strike. Okay. It's like, if you're trying to get way over there, you just jump off this thing, double jump, aerial ranged, then aim it somewhere way over there and talent strike across. You could probably make it over to that. So that would tower. be double jump, double jump, left trigger X. So yeah, jump off, double jump, left trigger, and then whoop, left trigger. And then, and then if you aim it like down on the base of that tower, yeah, down uh, there or up on the tower. Yeah, X. Oh, oh no, I get it. I get it. Here, I get it. We'll do it here. So, um, do you still have towers to climb and unlock in the environments? Uh, there are still towers. Actually, if you go into Wraith World and look around, you probably see. Uh, Some unlocks. Let's see where. Are there any visible from here? No. Yeah. So there's like a big flaming eye of Sauron on top of them, and you go up and uh, sort of take over his little like. They're called the Hadir. They're almost like mini Palantir little oh, yeah. stones. He'll bite you. Oh, not just, today. Right in the oh. mouth. Oh, off of the instant smooth. Now, um, is this going to be a PAX? Uh, yeah. You, yeah. you can play there? Yeah. Probably yeah. this demo, right? Yeah, it'll be this world. There we'll have a bunch of folks from Monolith helping show people the build. Absolutely. Hey, so where where is this? What system is this available on? So somebody wanted to know about the, about the system. Uh, this is actually a PC. Right, we're playing on PC right now. Uh, it'll be on PS4 or Xbox One. <laughs> Xbox One X, when it comes out, you can upgrade to that. You got the 4K HDR. Oh yeah, yeah. So, so like the like the the Game of the Year edition before we had the new PS Pro stuff. Right, right, right. Yeah. So we've got the support for ready to go, obviously, because high end PCs can Def do all that well, stuff anyway. Yeah, exactly. So, so just you can you can get access to all that the juice. Yeah. Is there any multi? <sighs> nice. Uh, that's it, dude. Nice. That's it. Nailed it. Yeah, it's, yeah me. it's us. How's it going, man? Uh, is there any multiplayer stuff? Yeah, so. Is there? Uh, it's sort of it's what? asynchronous, right? Like, you're not head to head in real time against people, but when you dominate, when you do the, the fort assaults, yeah. when you take over the fort, uh, it's not like, okay, story mission complete, move on. It's you pick who of your guys you want to make the overlord, of that pick place. who of your guys you want to make the war chiefs, oh, yeah. level it up, mm -hmm. upgrade it, and all that. When you do that... <laughs> I love a good pursuit. Makes the heart pound. Who's with me? Let's see how much you want this. Wrath breeder. <laughs> hmm. So I gotta catch this guy. Oh, no, we, we get to choose. Which of the two? Oh. Whoever wins will level up. And one of them's already higher level, right? Yeah. Yeah, so, uh, so yeah, when you dominate the forts, they basically go online as forts that other people can assault in the online uh, conquest mode. Oh, shit. Okay, so, and it's, it's basically configured and customized with all the stuff that you right. did, like your decision. So like your single player game is essentially building fun forts for other people to go assault in the multiplayer. So that's why, I mean, if you were to build an army of tasties, yeah. and you made a whole fort loaded with tasties, then somebody is going to go in multiplayer and just get a lot of tasty. Right. Oh, oh boy. Now who can we bring in to help us with this? You trying to help that foul suit get away? No, I was hitting him. And neither were you. I love his fur. Okay. Nice. All right, so you got your Karagor on the left D-pad. You yeah. got... Oh, and actually, if you go into the army screen, you can assign a bodyguard to bring in with the right D-pad. So, like, you can pick from your blue skull guys oh, so here. I could, I could grab my man. Yeah, two horn. horn. Oh, he's a spy though. Oh, so he's, right, I can't do he's that. He's off limits, or you'll, you'll expose him. Uh, you but get your mounted dude. Oshkrish. Yeah, go in there so with two Karagor. Make bodyguard. All right, now your right D-pad will bring that guy in. Okay. Just go! 
Well, these guys are in trouble. Oh. So you always have the ch on those abilities they have, you can often get your arrow proof. Oh. Uh oh. Yeah, you, you have to ride them around. I don't have to, but. No, I mean, I'm just saying it's, it's, they're, they're both good. But you can hit A to just get out of those, yeah, those, those out of character that. abilities. There we go. Right. Right. And if you hold the right trigger in B while you're on these guys, uh, you shoot? can dive off and, and oh. tackle a guy and oh. take it. Oh, I see. There you go. Yeah, you can. Oh. Oh. Get him! Oh. Oh, am I not dazing that guy? Out of my way. Nice. Over here. There we go. So now, what are my options with him? I see you recruit, recruit him. You fight for the bright Lord. Yeah, you do. Oh, he's also a bodyguard. Some buddies. So you can make him a spy. What's your man got to do with me? All right, make spy. Yes. If that's what you want. It is what I want. Nice. Ah, so then Hura gained a level and a new title. Oh yeah, now he's Hura Brawlmaster. Is he still right here though? Yes. Yes, he is. Right. Ooh. You gotta stun him first. He's one of the savages. Oh, he's getting stunned. Oh jeez. Oh, it's he just stuck stunned. right over. It's Yeah, and if he's just gonna be here, yeah. push right on the D-pad and bring in your other dude. This has been a very successful it three really minutes has. for you, Mike. I've been doing a lot of good recruiting. <laughs> it's, a, it's like a job fair for yeah. the Bright Lord. Uh, he's also a bodyguard. Everybody's a bodyguard. Everybody's a bodyguard. That's a, well, we, own, we own everybody. I mean, that's the thing, you put enough time in, you're gonna just waltz through the fort. Nope, sorry. See, there's your mans. Oh, yeah. It's like, what do you need me for again? Yeah. Sir. He showed up problem? a little late. Ow. He's here. I'm trying to get my toll coins. Yeah. That's what you get. Oh. There I am. This sniper shit. <laughs> Surprise! Oh, this fire's good. Ah. Can I not do that? X, X nice. into it. There you go. There we go. Now, should spiders come? Yes. Nice. Oh, yeah. That's it. There we go. Oh, yeah. Oh. Beautiful. That was so cool. Michael, you did all right. I did. Oh. What's his problem? Such a majestic beast of Mordor. Oh, he likes animals? I hear its spirit crying out. There's my spiders. <laughs> this spider's like, what the fuck is going on with this guy? You will pay the price for your treachery. Dude, you killed four animals just for your fucking shirt. Yeah, well, like, I don't... <laughs> a little bit of a hypocrite. Oh. Can I not jump on him? There we go. Oh! No. Not having it. That is a big guy. You gotta get the fuck out of here, dude. He's He has got beasts. Oh, oh, oh. shit! Oh, he does have a broken beast. Save yourself. Okay. I need a plan of attack. Oh! Oh, he's epic, too. 
Yeah, I need to so, get out of here. So if he's epic, that means we don't want it with him. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, no! Alright, I gotta escape. I do fear the beast. I fear the beast. Like, that's... That's yeah, a real you, thing. You don't gotta tell me oh, twice. worm. You can learn about him. Or just slap him in the face with your hammer. <laughs> Isn't it B? Hold B, hold B. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, now that we understand each other... Uh... Whew. Yeah, that's... Yeah, that dude is a real... Where does that guy live? Okay, it looks like he's down in the front row. Oh yeah, there he is. So you can hit A and learn about him. All right. Vulnerable Flammable. flames. Ooh. That's good news. Sick. Vulnerable to stealth. And he's sticky. No, he's, no, he's sickly. sickly. Oh, he's sickly. That makes more sense. <laughs> uh, he's covered. Okay. He's covered uh, in slime. Uh, so what's, but what systems is going to be available on? It's basically all the he new shit. Yeah, yeah. Right. Xbox so Xbox One, guy so Xbox, Xbox One, Xbox One X, PS4, PS4, PS4 Pro, PS4 Pro, PC. PC. Yeah. Oh jeez. Do the do the colors of the orcs indicate something? Is that their tri is that a tribal affiliation? Uh the, the The different skin colors. The colors so there's usually there's some amount of red, red or blue, depending on whether it's Sauron's team or your team. Yeah. Just to help with the kind of quick read who's a buddy, who's not. Yeah. But uh otherwise they yeah, a lot of their flair is determined by the tribes. Uh sometimes that's overridden by just if they have oh. a really unique personality or kind of whole role going on in, in the world. All right, so I feel like I escaped pretty well. Let's see, so I have, I have, I've seen enough now, uh, so, uh, somebody, so, uh, Malagrin from our channel wants to know what is different between the two games, but let me, let me see if I know some okay. of it, All right. okay? So the loot system, there's a lot more going on with the loot system. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Just like Michael did, he, Jesus, <laughs> you, you, you can also chain these assassinations. I would say the combat is got a, a little kick in the pants. Yeah. Uh, so we also have the ability, so uh, we are creating fortresses after we get done defeating them. We are creating fortresses mm -hmm. that we, uh, that become content for other people's single player campaigns. That's new. Yeah, so it's it's uh, the online conquest. You go, once you own a fort, yeah. there's a mission that's like, go assault other people's forts gotcha. in this area. So that's where all those get generated, and there's like a ranking system there for if you do well, earn more rewards. Exactly. Double jump. Double jump and fast climbing. Yeah. yeah. Double jump. Traversal. Yeah. There's a lot more traversal stuff. Oh yeah. Look at that. You're See, master, already right? pro tier. Whoa. There's Beradur being built back there. Oh shit. There's the Karagor sleeping here. Just, Aww. Just had to go wake him up and. I hate nature. All right, can I get in some trouble over here? I suspect. Yeah, so be, then being able to grab gems and then slot those in the new system. Mm -hmm. So basically, it's Nemesis. Oh, not enough ammo. Oh. Yeah. It's Nemesis up the yin. Uh huh. So uh -huh. the Nemesis engine, where things, where the world is sort of being generated. Based on your behavior, that's that now extends to weapons and. Uh huh. Nope. Exactly. There's just, I mean, frankly, just a crazy amount more content for all that stuff. Like the number of dynamic stories and different hooks that we've got to watch for how are you playing and what can we spring on you. Oh, so brother, there we go. Drive those weird little emergent stories with these guys. There's so much more possible. What are you doing here? I He'll use your pal. He's a he's your alchemist pal. I'm trying to I'm trying to think. To my mind, those are the ones that like moment to moment gameplay stick out. I mean, obviously, there's a yeah. whole the whole story campaign yeah, and things like that. The story and is a, bigger. The world's bigger. There's more regions. But there's there was DLC announced where you play as a different character. Uh huh. Uh huh. Is that right? Can you go into that? Uh, so I mean, we're just. I mean, what's available, right? Yeah, we're we obviously we're not really working on that stuff yet. We're still trying to finish the last bugs and and get this thing released. But yeah, uh, but we have the plan is to have uh, 
the first big story DLC where you play as the Blade of Galadriel, who's an elf assassin character you meet in the story. And then the second DLC where you play as Baranor, one of the Gondorians you meet at the beginning of the game. Oh, cool. Oh, nice! Oh. Oh, he wasn't having it. Oh, but then, but you're still here. Yeah, but he, 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 grabbed the, he grabbed the elf and threw him over there. Yeah. Nice, oh. nice. Good. Weaving in the range to combat is yeah. powerful. You're paying that is paying dividends. Yeah. That counter kill. Mm -hmm. uh, but the blade of Gladriel, my I mean, my assumption is that that is a female character. Yes. Yeah. yeah. And, and it's a whole campaign. It's, it's it's a campaign content for another play style. Right. Yeah. We can you can you are you can you bring can you play the regular content with the blade? Uh. We're still figuring out exactly know. how you we're gonna know. incorporate it. There should at least be like a skin or something where you can at least do that. Uh, and I just saw actually someone on Twitter posted their uh, cosplay they're working on for going to PAX. Nice. And, uh, they're doing the Blade of Galadriel's outfit and it looks so good. Oh, nice. Some intel on the board. I'll take it. Hold on, I gotta collect your intel. Billy Bung wants to know if there is an upgrade that lets you just knife someone in the face when they're trying to tell you their life story, <laughs> like all these guys want to do. Uh, that is a great idea. Consider it. I DLC will. options right there. Definitely. Snafu Goalkeeper. He's fireproof. He's immune to curses. Oh, He's beast proof. Hey, so after we get the fort, I assume that the fort looks different. So it depends, yeah, the look of the fort is driven by who's in charge, right? So what so, happens when we take it? So when you take it, you'll decide which of your loyal followers you want to oh, run this place. And so that and that will customize the right. level. Okay. Right. But but that's I can't go in and play in sconces. <laughs> right, now that's not down to that uh, level editor kind of manipulation. Are there are Kergor pretty dangerous? In uh, this, like if you're fighting the, this, I'm just going through the questions from the channel. Sure, yeah, like they certainly can tricky be. Tricky ones. Uh, oh, I mean, geez. stay out of my way, man. I I tend to watch wide varieties of people play. Yeah. So I see the full spectrum of people making short work of them and people getting owned by them. Yeah. So it obviously depends on your oh. your style. Oh. Nice. Oh, you can come down here to my sword. <laughs> right down on it. So so if we push right on the D-pad, can we send him home? Uh, hold it down, and you can tell him to get out of here. Yeah, because yeah, you, yeah, <laughs> you need to be in We're good. Way, dude. So that'll go on cooldown, and then after a while, you can bring him back in. Oh, so I feel like it might be worth um, strolling over towards the fort and seeing if you want to take a crack at the fort assault. Yeah, let's do it. Because because that our network's pretty robust. Yeah, you got a lot of spies involved now. So just in front of that icon, it's a little hard to spot because that one's. Highlighted so big. enormous. Uh, but yeah, head over that way actually. You don't okay. need to mark it. You'll just get there. That's where I was going anyway. So the overlord of this, you set those, um, as, the, as the designers, you set the sort of basic framework. It's all so it's all driven by the Nemesis system, right? So that the guys even, that, even the overlords the, of these zones. Yeah, he'll he'll be a random guy of a random tribe with different strengths and weaknesses. We just we make sure that he's high enough level for this spot in the game, and we make sure that uh, I mean the overlords when you start when you're playing through the story, the overlords they're going to be legendary, but that's about all we exercise in terms of control over. Yeah. who are these guys? We just let the system do its thing, and oh, really? and things hmm. can churn, right? Like if you if you develop a really nasty rivalry with someone in this zone, it's always possible that that guy will just get uppity and take over the the whole zone and become the overlord. So just go crazy. Is oh. it, it seems like it would be much more difficult to test a game that can be so. Wait, to test a game that that uh, creates itself. Yeah, that is true. And how do you decide what is a bug and what is uh, you know emergent gameplay? Exactly. I mean, honestly, there's so many features of the game that were a bug in a review, and then yeah, someone's yeah. like, "But if we wrote a line of dialogue, <laughs> then maybe it's a feature." Or make one more animation that makes it make sense. So which of these icons should uh, we so, look for? The uh, big gold one? The, this one to the right here with the two towers there. Yeah, there you go. Capture Goshkor. All right, so if you push X. All right, so now you can customize your assault party here. So if you have 
anybody. Oh man. Uh, all right. So you have Archaeus so many spies. Drake Killer. Yeah. That's nice, and he's legendary too. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Right. So yes. so we so we want him on the we want him on the roster, right? Totally. It seems totally pretty so, clear. Okay. Look at this motherfucker. Wow. So you have one. What's guy on his back? That's a um, poison tank or some kind. It looks like he will actually. If you click the right stick, you can yeah, see his details. He, uh, he doesn't like spiders. That's okay, fair. Okay, so you might want to not bring spiders with you. Uh, and... True. You might want to change out your spider. Fireproof, poison proof, frost proof, and immune to curse. So nobody's gonna mess with him with elemental nonsense. He's enraged by <laughs> everything. <laughs> Dude, look at this. Hates everything. He's like Larry David. That's of great. Orcs. And enraged by Drake. So if you can bring a Drake with you, that'd be good. I don't I'd... like Drake either. Uh, let's see. <laughs> no, no, dude, 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 you have to, just for us, you have to edit that so that it goes out and just says, Enraged by Drake. <laughs> <laughs> just doesn't like Drake. <laughs> really doesn't like Drake's new stuff, likes his old stuff. Uh, okay, so here's all my assault leaders. Uh, okay, so there's one more slot you could put a guy in if you had another follower around, but all your dudes are... Uh, either spies or that you've got yeah. you've got the alchemist who's your bodyguard right, right now. So okay. you could tell the alchemist not to be your bodyguard and put him here, but you've got him on call. So right. you know, normally you could go out and dominate another guy, but also next to each of those guys is upgrades oh, for yeah. the assault. So that's another place to spend some of that Mirian and uh, so, so I can go in here and yeah, oh. and buy sh uh, buy the shit. Army is supported by a war, and the things that I can purchase are based on. Their classes. Their, who that uh, guy is? The so assault leader. These are uh, each slot in your assault party is going to have these things. Okay, it's it's determined by the slot, not who's yeah. in. Yeah, yeah, okay. exactly. But it won't be active unless you've got a guy there to bring it. Sure. Yeah. So yeah, so you got the choice here: of mounted cavalry or sappers. So guys will some money. They'll just run at the Dude, doors you have, and blow them up. You have cash. What, where should I invest my money to make the most? A group of Olag High that destroy the wall. That seems good. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. I have. To, I'm just gonna buy it. I want to see that. It's okay. a thousand bucks. I've got plenty. All right. So uh, savage axe wielding shock troops. Uh, defenders. Okay. Oh. Hold on. What do you mean capture victory points? Is it like a multiplayer match when we get in there? Yeah. So the the way this mission is gonna play out is yeah you you bring your big army in and there's spots you have to like take and hold and then what? you know plant your flag. Attacking army field siege beasts that rain fiery destruction. I like that. So you got your choice of what type of siege beast. So the fire ones are gonna wreck the, the oh, walls clouds. and towers. Yeah. The poison ones are gonna wreck the enemy beasts, and the cursed ones will go after the army and try and freak them out. So uh, what do you like? Uh, I probably kind of depends on what they've got going on over here. Uh, so if we push over there and see what they're bringing. Yeah, so he's got a beast master as one of the war chiefs there, so there might be a good amount of Karagors around. Right. Uh, and they, it looks like he's got Graug. Poison? Yeah. So yeah, the poison might be a good choice. Because it looks like this guy's going to bring a Graug with him. That's his upgrade, I think. Okay. So if I do a, a wild oh, Drake, I I feel like that's, that's like a plus. Oh, no, 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 we don't want to do that because uh, no. our dude hates Drake. Oh, but that's that's a good thing in this case because he's on your side. So when he gets enraged, he just goes ape shit and starts. Wrecking you brought everybody. a Drake. Yeah, yeah, it's like what the fuck I did I tell you? You brought Drake to this party. <laughs> yeah, so you want to avoid the things he's afraid of, but when he's on your team, go ahead and piss him off. That I'm gonna just go make him more powerful. Siege beast. Yeah. Oh well, yeah. Call. And it'll get rid of their beasts too. Yeah. All right, so am I good to go? I think so. I think so. Yeah, so you, you put start. the money in. Did, so, did you get those dudes that are gonna kick the wall over? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I did. Oh man, I want to see it. So this is my crew. Yeah, yeah, right. There yeah, he is. There you got the. Yeah, there's my guys. There. There's the savage orc axe wielding yeah. shock troops. Oh, there's my big guy. Uh huh. Level 300. Dude, is the Overlord gonna come out and talk shit? <laughs> <laughs> you broke those other forts, but not this one! This one is gonna break you! <laughs> I get it, okay. You need not fear the dark, brothers. But what you will fear is what lies within it. Mm. Waiting for you. 
All right, well, sure. Let's see. Will you come on? One more four, boys. That's awesome. These are all my guys. The bright lord will control them all. Okay. Ready? Go crazy. What? Now I'm just going? Holy shit. He's already mad. He saw that Drake. <laughs> He's pissed. So, this, so, so is that A there? Capture point A? Right, exactly. So can we, can we kill the siege engine ourselves? Yeah, so if you aim at it, he's got these big ammo packs. Oh shit. Sure. Sure. Looks like your, up here? your siege beast just unloaded on him. You could also mount your own siege beast. Uh, and use it to and fire shoot it. shit? Yeah. What? So right bumper up on that guy. Whoop, or just throw you around. That. Oh, you, hi. yeah, you again. <laughs> is, it, hold, is this your management <laughs> system? trying to keep him honest. <laughs> Oh, so yeah, I can aim up at the other Siege Beast to take him out. It's a right trigger. A little higher. Oh, you got okay. him. Nice. Gross. Okay. And if you dismount this guy, you'll break his backpack off and he'll just run in as a normal grab. So you can start coming over the walls to help. Oh. Ha! <laughs> So you can actually even mount him, right? Uh, or no? Right where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh, they he, might have hit him as you got off. He, yeah, he's gone forever. So they, yeah, they bashed the walls down now. Yeah, they so did. Just rush through. Weird. So now I'm trying to get to. Oh, there's there's, there's one of your two horn. Oh, oh, he wasn't oh, ready for spies. two horns. The spies are all in there. Yeah. Dude, Scott Tasty's out. Oh. Drake killer. And we're getting XP? Oh, yeah, you got a bunch of dudes sitting on this capture. Jesus, that's a lot of guys in there. It's crazy in here. We, we need to get these it. archers off of here. Why'd you have to attack this wall today? I had plans and you ruined it. Uh oh, sorry. <laughs> it is pretty inconsiderate. Got a new plan. All right, so it's ready to capture now. You got all your guys on it. So you bounce down in there and hit down on the D-pad. Plant the flag. Oh! Push forward to the square. Next point. Is that a piece of gear? Yeah. yeah. So we're here in close. Cloak. Scott Tasty. <laughs> <laughs> well, I gotta see what Scott Tasty's cloak does. Dude, Scott Tasty is. It should be the subtitle. Yeah. It should be Middle Earth Shadow of War Scott Tasty. <laughs> okay, so you can you can destroy these items for cash too if we That's want. That's true. Yeah. Get better oh. stuff. Yeah, what? Well, no, the, the, the look, I mean, that's, that's yeah. how it should oh, yeah. be. Right, it's changing out depending on what you equip. Yeah, that's how the Rohirrim cloak should look in his mind. So here's the next point. Look at this drooler. Yuck. <laughs> I mean, if you don't want to die, uh, I mean, if you want to die, I'm, well, this is the place you die. <laughs> <laughs> I love the orcs. Oh, immune, immune to execution. Yeah, he is. And he's enraged and by them. Oh, he's just enraged by them. You got so many buddies with you. This, you gotta do this. Okay, should we bring it? Should we, should we summon our. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hit, hit right on the D pad. Oh, no. I am in the bone oh, zone. No. I am deep in the bone zone. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, God. I'm oh okay, right? You're fine, yeah. You? You should have run away when you had the chance! Like a coward! I should have. Instead of fighting! You coward! <laughs> <laughs> He's great. 
Okay, so so Shaka is like, hey, I did a great job. Siege failed. Did I lose the game? Is the game over? So Do I have to uninstall it now? Yeah, we delete your save file at this point. Wow, no. <laughs> that's hardcore. So time moves on. Uh, yeah, so these guys leveled up a bit. Uh, if if you had like taken out one or two of the war chiefs along the way, that would have been progress you'd banked. But right. none of them actually died, or maybe. I thought one of them died. Maybe it was just tasty. Uh, the war will be long, Talion. I mean, can, is there anything stopping me from just trying it again? You can, you can keep going at it. I mean, you sometimes you didn't lose any of your guys on that run, so you're not any weaker for it. But, uh, but you get a sense now of like it's not a cakewalk. It's not. Uh, so doing the the work up up front to install spies and take out war chiefs can actually be really worth it. Now, Chainsaw Gothic has got the right idea. Like that- these orcs are great. Like, you should. There has to be an orc campaign. All right. So the the closest thing I think spiritually to that is if you take one of your guys who's not already a spy, yeah. and you want to make him a spy, you send him after a, a war chief slot, and uh, he'll at least go into the fight pit. And you have to just watch those play out. So it's like you can pretend yeah. a little bit. You're not actually in there as Talion mixing it up. We'll give you a good fight, Grey Walker. We really will. It's just. We have to try to stop laughing <laughs> and how badly you clogged it up last time! Oh, <laughs> that's not cool. That's not cool at all. Torches if you got them. Might help you burn some stuff. Might help you see. But I won't keep the darkness away from you. Give command. We attack. Come on in, boys. <laughs> this maggot's running Their morale is still high. It's time we get our master his final fault. Yeah, I mean he's he's reliable. Yeah. Okay. Play smart. I'd say from right here, you just aim up at those siege beasts. Yeah, right. And you see the glowing little pack on his on the back. Yeah, right there. Shoot that. Boom. And then one more. Boom. And now, if you aim at him, oh, I see. you can B button. Oh no, he died. Okay. Shadow when mount. When he's broken, you can just shadow mount him from here. Oh. Shadow him and then you put him to work inside? Yeah. Oh, there's your Drake, by the way. There you go. Th- okay, this this <laughs> this could be sick. Turn that shit all the way around in here. Turn it around. Hey guys. Yeah, just turn the beat around. Oh, your Drake's on the ground over here. Oh, hop off, you can mount the Drake too. What? Hit the right bumper. Yeah. If you aim down at the Drake. Or up momentarily. And B button. Air transfer. Yes! <laughs> okay. Skate park this thing. So does he does he fly where he wants? Uh, so you you fly him around. You can hold down the right trigger and breathe fire. Uh, these controls are inverted. Uh, so tap tap A to flap the wings and fly faster. Oh yeah yeah okay I get it. And then if you hold the left trigger, you can just go into hover, aim, breathe fire. We should, we, should, we should get these archers. Oh, yeah. Nice. Took of the hatchet. Oh, they killed him. It's okay. No, no, no. Oh, hi. Right. Out of all the people, I remember him from last yeah, time. Yeah, I remember you. He said he had plans. To be you. <laughs> Fine. Let's get this done. Okay. Still immune to executions. No, that took a chunk. Oh, did it? Yeah. Oh, you can just dominate him. Yeah. If you get the room. Got it. There we go. There we go. Now, do we want him? Do we want him to help out in here? I say fight to the death, right? Well, so if you recruit him, then you can tell him to stick around and fight with you. What do you wish of me? Wish of me. So stay and fight for me. Now he's just going to join your assault here okay. and fight alongside you now. Yeah. I could use a hand. Capture the point. So I got the gatehouse. Nice. Next we're going there. Yeah, I mean, let 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 them yeah. start most of this shit. And then we can just get good assassinations. Pick up bleeding. some of this elf shot. What's this here? Oh, okay, so your guy's bleeding out down there. You can go save him. Uh, if you go find, where is he? Yeah. 
I'm down whole B this, next this to him. This should be a stealth help. <laughs> <laughs> the whole B. There you go. Nice. Okay. That. Poison. Take one of those. There's a lot of loot over here. Oh, the Numenorian dagger. Let's just take a look at it real quick. What? Ooh, nice. Oh. Man, they're cutting them down out there. Another one of your guys is down. <coughs> go help him. We can fix it. Mm -hmm. Got more important business to attend. Yeah, exactly. What did I pick up there? Dagger. You do have a pretty sweet dagger on already. Yeah, I don't yeah, know. yeah. It's gonna yeah, be yeah. hard to beat. Yeah. Well, yeah, no, well because we, we leveled it up. So it's that second. It, it's no good? Well, it's not as high. Yeah, yeah it's, it's like not six as high a number. Lower. That's all I look at. <laughs> I can go over here and help him. Oh no! Is this? Uh That's the guy that killed you last time. Oh! Uh -oh. oh. Stop it! Oh! You got so many guys on this point. It's ready to capture already too. You. Back? Yeah. Uh, I killed you. <laughs> uh, I killed you dead. <laughs> You're back? <laughs> <laughs> the second one's too good. You're gonna die here. I might. <laughs> oh! Oh man. Oh, you could add him, him to your him, army. Get him, get him, dude, put him in the mix. No, he's too great. Okay. He's too dumb. Oh no, he's enraged. Uh oh. Does that mean I can't anymore? You got it. Yeah. Oh yeah, I can't execute this guy. Yeah, you gotta wait for the rage to wear off before you can dominate him. He got enraged by mortal wounds. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Now we lost one of our guys, but he left loot. That's true. Yeah, when your guys oh, die, no. it's still okay. You get some consolation prize. And it'll be connected. To, it'll be connected to him. Yeah. Shit. Man, our awesome guys are getting chewed up the farther in we get. But they are capturing those points for you. This is impressive. Yeah. Oh. Oh, I missed. I hit that wall. You've yet to win the battle. Hoglick? This is where your petty foray ends. Yeah. Why do they call you Hoglick, man? Does that deal damage? It stuns, I think. Save your dude. Yeah. Oh. Close. Oh, there nice. There we go. What a good boss. <laughs> Let him handle it. Yeah, really. <laughs> He's hitting him hard. Nice. <laughs> he just keeps picking him up. Nope. Still remember, you can summon uh, the alchemist with oh, the yeah. right D-pad. Oh, true. Yeah, we have a Karagor too. Mm -hmm. Is it pure torment to watch people play your video game? Uh, it is. It can be. In this case, he's actually really good. So oh, it's okay. Fun. All right. Oh. I think Jerry. Can we was bring him in. Insult me. Oh. Just keep adding, or yeah. Fruit. Yeah. Come on board. I just had a couple positions open up. Stay and fight with me. And stop licking hogs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like I got I only got two things. Oh shit! Dude! Nazu the twins, man! You guys Dude, are doing work. He's going ham. Stack the screamer. They are tearing this place a fucking part. 
What is the collective noun for Olog High? I think Olog High is plural. Yeah, too. yeah. Hey, so if you have an overlord of this whole place, I like this. Oh! There it is. Uh, can they, can we see them again in the future? Like, do those. Uh, like once you get into the, the keep here and you yeah, face him, yeah, yeah, he's just a guy like like any other captain okay, so, in the okay, nemesis so, system. So he so. might have a nemesis system. He might re he might reappear later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, you could dominate him, you could shame him, you could kill him and have him cheat death and ha. all that stuff. It's a whole lot of bugs. He hates bugs, I think. I see the uh, the chat. Can you assign uh, MVPs at the end of this and hand out rewards? That's like, <laughs> that's the the final thing here. If you can pull this off, then you get to actually decide who's going to be in charge. Oh, shit. You literally determine the MVP. Make them the overlord. Oh, shit. Oh, hold on. Did you, there's, a, there's a real little song for Narug. That's right. They're chanting for him. Every name in the game gets... <laughs> the dream so did you have like a choir and you're like, okay, uh, Maku <coughs> guy. Yeah, pretty much. Wow. Oh! Betrayal! Oh shit! Yeah! Betrayal! I mean, granted, your, your boy's alone back there with sure. a whole bunch of nasty. Good luck with that, though. Oops. They're, they're cool. They're cool. They're bros. Oh, Gondorian armor from Skak! Oh, save oh, your no. friend, save your friend! Oh, save my friend. Yeah, you do. Lord. Yeah, you do. Nope. Oh yeah, all those bosses are dishing up real shit. Premium loot. There. What? <laughs> <laughs> What's going on with him? Oh, so we're just trying to get in. Yeah. One of them is broken back there. Yeah. Oh! Right into the middle of it. Brave soul. In the back might be the only... Oh, now he's enraged too. Everybody's enraged. Good. Boy, well, I like it. Enraged by everything. Well, then you're enraged by nothing, Maku. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bleeding. Oh, yeah, you got this. Boom. Enjoy. Is it? A tide of Uruk iron. Oh, we're going to have some fun with you. Oh, he's got some friends here. Oh, what? What? <laughs> the so bugs. A, the thing about enrage is they just kind of go crazy and hate everybody. So occasionally we'll see them beat each other to death. <laughs> it happened. Yeah, let's get up. Got some more siege beasts up here. You can. Oh, oh, oh! Jeez, dude, and Hura is Hura is new to the squad. Yeah, he's already doing work. What are you hey, doing? Fuck you! you. Stop it! Do you, do you see what I did down there? All right, so you can still call in the alchemist. Oh, bring him in! Bring him in! Oh, you! I you let him. Metal Beard bleed. He was complaining anyway. Yeah, he, yeah. He was not really dedicated. None of this shit. No. Stop it. All right. Where were we? Oh, you can shoot the barrel. Yeah. He's broken. Oh, big fella. Uh huh. That's not cool. Oops. I'm trying to dominate him. There we go. Nice. You will uh, yeah. I got a lot of your friends on board. I think you're gonna recognize some faces. What? <laughs> <laughs> well, this, this, this is what you have to understand uh, or hack on. Uh, you know, obviously, we're a growing organization. <laughs> yeah. A lot of room for upward mobility. Nope, I don't mean to be hitting you. 
Oh, it's not even blue yet. He's just... <laughs> there you go, right there. Help. Oh, dream. Oh, stop hitting me. Oh, he dealt with it. Yeah, he did. Bam. Okay, so... Man, I'm getting so much gear, I... If this was my actual game, I'd be... ass deep in that gear right now. It's... yeah. Look at this tide of blue orcs. That's really fun. Nope. Nope. Right through your head. Yeah. That's how I do it. You got another guy bleeding out back there, but okay. you can decide if you just want to let him go. Wait, you can decide what kind of organization you want to run. Yeah, he's pretty far away. He's super inconvenient. Hey, so... Uh, where does this happen in the space of the lore? Uh, right. Middle Earth. So, um, oh. both the last game and this one happened inside, uh, in the space between The Hobbit and The Fellowship of the Ring, right? Oh, so it's all before that. Uh, yeah, so The Hobbit happens, uh, then Shadow of Mordor begins. Yeah. Shadow of War follows on from that story, and there's about a 80-year-ish period between yeah. Hobbit and Lord of the Rings that we are occupying here. Oh, you're gonna go all the way up just to get a good view? Yeah. Yeah, I want to give a speech from where this asshole was giving a speech. So, is it mine now? No. So you have to go in the keep and fight the Overlord now. So you got oh, okay. the outside taken care of. You might want to drain a couple captives just to top off your health before you go inside. That's how I like them. Is that what they're yeah. for? Uh, that's certainly how I use them. Yeah. Where are they at? Are they... Uh, go around the corner, maybe there's some... Some out there. So these will be just like prisoners out here? Yeah, any, any of the... Enemies who were left either fled or they dropped to a knee, and really, worst case scenario, just just, just drain your own guy. Yeah, just that's good teamwork. It'll do anything for the cause. Yeah. All right, so now I got to go in here through the front door. Go into the evil door. Now, now at this point, is it like one v one? Well, if you don't count the hordes of other guys he has supporting him. Well, I know that he has he has more than some of his dudes just run away. Yeah, so he's got... Wow, he's look got, at this fucked up place. Oh, yeah. It's quite the throne room. Yeah, but do we bring in our bros? You are a brave human no. You only years. have who you've got on your D-pad to call in. Uh, okay. You'll be a dead human. Not likely. Yeah, so we want Karagoras. We want our alchemical dude. Yeah, I'm dude. gonna get Karagor and alchemical guy. He's not an attractive orc. No. And if you uh, left bumper, oh, and he's got poison spouts in here. Right stick. Oh no. Jeez. Poison spouts. Basically, he poisoned what? his own guys. He did. Yeah. He's. He don't give a fuck. Dude, the only way we're gonna get through this is if you. Well, first of all, we're never gonna survive unless we get a little crazy. Crazy, yeah. But you're gonna have to do your multi kill. Yeah. I feel like the character is going to work over there, too. Alright, remember, you gotta be stunned oh, those yeah. guys. This is a tough one. He's got a bunch of Ologs and Savages. You need to get energy from. Oh. Oh yeah, I remember that full to X charge up. Yeah. Nope. Our, I think our timer is good for our friend. Alchemist on call. Okay. There he is. The poison spouts are not necessary. No. Although it does definitely sell the idea of a, a evil mastermind. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. oh, that was awesome. Right, 
Yeah. The ranger is definitely here. What gave it away? He's in the building. Will they just keep coming? Or does he have a, a certain amount of guys in here? Uh, you should probably start doing some damage to him, because yeah. they will respawn periodically. Boy, they really don't like it when you climb You're hurt bad. I know that. You think I don't know that? <laughs> Oh! Nice. Yeah, let him nice. chew on him for a while. Yeah. So he he, do not, he does not want to be climbed on. No, like he doesn't. Gym. But I I keep forgetting that. Nice. Nice. Oh, these guys. Ow. <laughs> nice. Oh. Oh, it's not a fucking pay PlayStation. <laughs> I was like, no, I did hit X. Oh, shock of the steer. Damn. Such a mouthful anyway. <laughs> I could do it the third time. Okay, so well, I guarantee you could. Now that you've got this far, at least this yes. is this is the break that we will cut you. Uh, where if you make it all the way into the throne room, going back after him, you don't have to recapture the entire floor. Oh, I mean, okay. You, you can see you laid waste to everybody yeah. anyway. So now it's it's just if you start that mission again, it's just go in the front door and he's just hiding him. in there. Yeah. Okay. I think You're you so can close. do it. You should check his strengths and weaknesses too. Make sure you know what prepared. to exploit. Uh, so army and Gorgoroth. Got a stinger. Okay, yeah, it's your Okay, you That's can good. skill tree. Uh huh. Oh, there is oh, the summon, summon, a, summon a Grog. Okay, that would be helpful. He is damaged by ranged attacks. Keep that in mind. Execution. Ooh, and Shadow Strike. Explosions. Okay. And uh, what's he hate? Mortal Wounds, Stealth, Curse, Ghouls, Poison. All right. So everything. Yeah. Yeah, he doesn't like any of that stuff. But if we go into our, if we go into our character builder. Right. I go here, here. And yes. And I go down to. Oh, no skill points. I have no skill points. Oh, I have no skill points. It's okay. I'll beat him with my bare hands. Well, no, because. That same, the power that would have gotten you that grouch should have let go in the crack of doom. Is going to get I you dying. I could have been reunited with my family. Uh, you'll be able to. Italian. You use that to get a character. Our work is not yet done. I, and so it changes the name of the quest. Now it's unfinished uh, business. And you don't choose any stuff. Right. You just can go and fight. I yeah. got it. Hey, remember me? Here, Sublime Spider wants to know if you could just shoot the Overlord from the entryway before his dialogue starts. Uh, I don't know. We'll try. Let's see it. Get, get your bow out. Nope. Nope. Like they won't no. even let me draw the bow. <laughs> Looks like we're smarter than that. These designers, they think of everything. <laughs> the human failure returns to yeah. my fortress. Yeah. You're being kind of a jerk, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'll enjoy hurting you again. Yeah, well, we'll see about that. Yeah, and his spear is covered with gross stuff. Yeah. So he has his rowdy friends. Oh, right into it. Nice. Oh! Ah! Oh! Oh! Ah! Oh no! It's okay. He slid through the legs. Nice. Legs. All right, now. So you you have all kinds of buddies. 
got this. Abdicate your will. Whoa! Nope, I meant to jump on the other guy. I like this. Oh, oh. Wait, no, you're. Oh, shit. Run, run, run. Oh, no. No. Okay. Nice. Now, your, your Karagor and your friend are both ready to come in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, he's got damn. like his fucking damn. back. Oh, shit. Okay, look out. Okay. I oh. might want to try and get some space and drain somebody. I'm never giving up this full right up. Okay. No how much it hurts. We'll see about that. I'm rooting for you. Delish. Yeah. Oh, get him, get him. Oh. You jerks. Execution. Yeah. There we go. Get him, get him, get him. Oh, oh you piece of shit. Got him, come on! Yes! yes. Alright. Yes! Woo. Okay, so he's too high level. He is too high level. So you have no choice but to shame him, which I think you uh, wanted yeah, to do anyway. That's my whole plan. <laughs> the staples in your face are dumb! <laughs> nice. Ugh. So this is my keep now? You're about to let everybody know that that's the case. Hey, no, everybody, everybody stop fighting. Victory is ours! We have Hawaiian Fridays! Sauron cowers before us! We have taken his fortresses and made them our own! Now, we stand at the very edge of history! Only one conquest remains! And Mordor will be ours! Pretty cool, man. So, has anyone ever captured a fortress before? No. Am I the first person to do it? Uh, I have to say, I think you should consider playing on hard difficulty when a game comes out because you maybe did an impressive job at that. Thank you. That's really fun. Right, and there's there's all of our dudes. Yeah. yeah. Oh, so you, man, you can, so you get a heap of fucking XP. Oh, board. here. So now, so now we can okay. now we get to go through our so roster. Who do we like? Who did the best work? There's Hura. Hura was new. Two Horn is nice. Two Horn did a good job. Urhakan is brand new. Nazu the twins was working. Nazu the twins was definitely doing some shit. But Archaeus the Dra Archaeus Drakeclair helped us out too. Uh, the Beast guy. Like like the, the guy in the back, the one who's riding around the alchemist. Yeah, I mean he oh. he was our right hand man for most of these fights, and he was there when we defeated the boss too. Something to consider. I feel like Two Horn. Two Horn started early. Yeah, right. He's been with us for he, a long time. No, he we killed you. Yeah, exactly. Back at him. Now we identified him early on. So you can see what they make the look the fort look like too when you're looking at them. So he's from from the machine tribe. So you got oh, the big kind so of. So they industrial. each have a different skin. Yeah. Fort yeah. Yeah. Basically. So who else do we got? So the terror, terror tribe stringing up. Oh, I like torture that. Torture victims. Oh, weird. That's pretty cool. What else you got? Barrel. Ugh. It's all spikes. Bones and Bones shit. Bones everywhere. Oh, he's the twins has the. He's oh. got the. It's uh, a oh, face. He's oh. cool. You know what? He killed a lot of guys. And he has that, his face is kind of and fucked up. he's got up. two faces. So, because he's Feral Tribe, yeah, it makes the fort look different, but also there's gonna be more beasts around the zone, and like, oh. there's more drake bait all around, so... Oh, to get him? Yeah, there's there's uh, some different things that'll happen across the kind of open world in the region. Oh, then you change, and then you change the palette? Yeah. So the sun came yeah. out? Yep. 
different lighting and everything for these guys. Nice. That's pretty rad. Well, Amazing. Here, I was gonna say, so what what else can we what else can we learn in the two minutes that we <laughs> Yeah. Uh you know I feel, I feel like, like I did it all, this right? This is a pretty epic tour of uh, building up to a fort assault, and I can't imagine a better, better timing here of like getting in there. Yeah. I mean, well, you no, died I mean, a few I mean, times, this, I I mean exactly. Like this is like the two-hour experience. I mean, you have to, you have to feel good. It's, it's usually we get to like play for 20 minutes or something. Right. It's really hard to see things come together in 20 minutes. Well, I mean, they're sweeping. Keep sweeping, assholes. <laughs> I keep my fort clean. <laughs> You got time to lean. You got time to clean. Now, I, these are my guys, but can I just, yeah, I can just drain them, right? Yeah, you can drain any guy. Yeah, I can drain any guy I want. Deal with it. All right, there's some of the Drake bait. So you can... Where is it? The big carcass there. You oh. shoot that, it'll dissolve and a Drake will come in. Gross. Uh, they're like, man, that was our fucking Drake bait. I guess, well, that's I guess, fine, I guess. Took us five months to get that. That's cool, as long as you had fun. <laughs> oh. Just leave you guys with this. There he uh, is. Oh, <laughs> shit! Not a friendly Drake. Oh, you okay. were... Okay. okay, not a cool that Drake. That was ambiguous. Yeah, yeah, not a, not a Drake. I that thought we meant pet a, Drake. A Drake, not a, a Drake or Tunity. Not a bro. Uh, not a bro. Well, yeah. I mean, Bob he, Roberts. He can be. Yeah, Bob thank Roberts, you very much. Who is also Robert Roberts, but via a circuitous route that we discussed uh, during the time. Thank you for bringing out uh, this PC with this cool game on it uh, for us to play. Thank yeah. you guys, it's so much fun. I had a super good these. time. Absolutely, so, and you're hanging out at PAX? Oh yeah. Okay, I will come and harangue you there. Stream, uh, thank you so much for your questions and uh, you, for chat. hanging out this afternoon. And uh, hopefully I'll have a chance to see a few of you at the show. Yeah, see you at PAX. See ya. Thanks.